up y'all, it's your girl Kayla Denise and as you guys can tell by the title, today I'm going to be doing a no makeup, everyday dewy makeup. I feel really naked because I have no lashes on, so. It's going to be time to get used to this, even though I'm only going to do this video. But, it's a very quick and easy look. All the products I used are practically drugstore products. Um, so yeah, it's really not that hard to do this look at all. So, if you guys want to learn how to do it, keep on watching. Okay, so I hope it's like straight, because I'm not sure. Anyways, so I'm gonna just go ahead and get right to the tutorial. So I already did my lashes and my eyebrows. Um, I used the Lash Station Mascara by Maybelline and the Lash Paradise Mascara by L'Oreal. So yeah, um, and then for my brows, I actually use a brow pencil from Elf. So very affordable for both brands. Um, most of this, actually, I think this all of this makeup is drugstore makeup, except one. But you can get powder, that kind of powder from anywhere. So let's go ahead and get into the tutorial. So first thing I'm gonna do is clean my skin, and I'm gonna use a Glacier um, Chemical Exfoliator. This is really good. It's a little pricey. I don't even think it's gonna be considered a drugstore, but you can use any type of toner. You can use witch hazel. You can use um, shoot. There's different brands, so like you know, just clean your face. Get a nice toner. Any toner you want. Just make sure your whole face is clean because you don't want to start off with a dirty canvas. I'm about to go in with the e.l.f. Glow Radiant Moisturizer. It looks like this and it's actually one of their newer products and we're going to use this because we want this everyday look to look a little more glowy just because it's an everyday look and it's the springtime. Matte season is almost over so we're trying to look a little dewy out here, okay? So I'm just going to take this and rub it all over my face. By the way, if you guys want a brow tutorial, let me know. I do do my brows differently every now and then. So like, if it's gonna be a brow tutorial, I'm just gonna give you probably these type of brows. I'm not sure. But some days I like seeing your brows, some days I like thicker brows, it all depends. But um, today as you can tell, I'm going for more like a natural brow. So. But now look at my face. Let's compare it. Oh my god, I could just wear this alone. But we're not gonna do that today. <laughs> so next, I'm gonna go in with my Sephora Bright Future. Um, they consider this a skin tint. It has sunscreen in it, so it's good for if you're going out in the sun. And I'm in the shade 44, which is Proline. This went on sale a few weeks back, or a few months back when I got it. So I'm not sure if they still have it or not. I'm pretty sure they do, but you never know nowadays. So if they do, um, you can use this. I recommend a skin tint or like what they call a BB cream if you're going for an everyday no makeup look. So I'm gonna be using this. It's not heavy, it's not as heavy as foundation, it's very light. It's almost like if you were to put on like a concealer. It's probably lighter than that actually. Because this is a skin tint, it's not like full coverage. So keep that in mind when you buy this. It's not full coverage. And I'm just gonna put that all over my face. You might be able to see some imperfections, but really not a lot. It's semi-coverage, I guess, like medium coverage-ish. I don't know, I personally don't have a lot of things going on in my face. So, it might look a little better on my skin just because I don't have a lot of dark marks. Like, I have some marks on this side, but you can't really see them, even without this, so. But I look at this as like a white foundation, to be honest. All right, so now we're done with that step. So I'm gonna go in with this Bare Minerals Matte um, Powder. It's in the shade Golden Medium. And I'm gonna use this to highlight. Now notice I'm not using concealer because this is a no makeup makeup look and I don't wanna use too much makeup. <laughs> so we're just gonna use a little bit of this to highlight our face. And I'm gonna be, by the way, I use the Eco Tools brush for the foundation. This is the Wonder Cover Complexion. And then I'm about to use the Morphe M554 brush to apply this powder. So I'm gonna get a little bit of powder and I'm gonna like dust it off as much as we can. And then I'm gonna, I'm not gonna really bake, I'm gonna press it under my eyes. So we're just gonna, you know, 
do it again. I'm gonna put because we're not trying to make it look like we have a lot going on in our face. That's the whole point of this look. So just take your powder. If you did too much on that side, hurry up and press it to the other side and then go back. And we're just doing this to you know brighten up under our eyes a little bit, but not too much. And I'm also gonna do this on my nose and on my chin. And then some people they put it on their eye. I'm gonna do that today as well. Because I don't want fully eyelids. So I'm just take some powder and press it onto my eye. Probably should have got a smaller brush, but it's whatever. And just you know do what you gotta do, okay? So now I'm gonna go in with bronzer. I'm gonna do this lightly as possible. I'm gonna take my True Complexion Contour Palette in Medium to Dark from Black Radiance. And I'm gonna be using, this is a Makeup Shack brush. Does it have a name? Oh, it's their T17 brush. I love it, honestly. I would buy this again if I were to lose it. So, we got a little bit. Tap the excess off if you need to be. I don't have a lot, so. And then just take it and place it where you want to place it. It's not enough <laughs> at all, but. I like to contour my cheeks, my nose, forehead. You can go on your jawline if you would like, but this is a no makeup makeup look, so I'm gonna try to make this look as natural as possible. collection glam um i think that is actually the name is glam so i'm gonna take that light blush color dab in a little bit don't want to dab too much tap the excess off if you need me and we're just gonna put it a little bit above our brow oil now we're gonna put it a little bit under where we will put our highlight so literally right here you don't see it but i kind of do idea that you put it there whatever <laughs> and then also in that palette I'm gonna take the highlighter shade with the elf blush brush by the way I used a makeup shack brush for that and this is the brush t27 so taking the elf blush brush a little bit of highlighter tap up excess a little brush this is the I don't even know it doesn't have a name but it's like a eyeshadow brush and I'm gonna take that put it under my brow and put it on the inner corners of my eyes just a little bit okay all right and last but not least get you a good I'm using the Fenty Beauty lip gloss in the shade, it's bad, I don't know, Fenty Glow. It's the first one. And I'm gonna put that on my lips. I already had something before, but I'm gonna do this a little more. And boom. Now all you gotta do is spray some setting spray. This is the Pro Fix by Makeup Revolution. Let that dry And you're done. That's it. Every day, no makeup, makeup look. You still look good, but it looked like you didn't do that much. So yeah, thank you for watching. All right, you guys, so that concludes this whole video. Hopefully you guys liked it. It was quick and easy. I only took a few products. They're all affordable. They're all drugstore. And yeah.
yeah, it's really simple. As you guys can tell, this is just, you know, quick on the go to make up look definitely for school, or work, wherever you're going. So if you guys liked it, don't forget to click that like button. Do it right now. Give you some time. Hit that like button. That like. Hit that like button. That like. Okay. And don't forget to also click that bell so you guys can be notified when I post again. I did post yesterday or you'll see. I did post before this video so don't forget to check that video out as well. And also um, give me some more ideas um, on videos please um, because I am running. I don't really know what to do like what videos to do. So um, yeah give me some more videos, some suggestions on what videos you guys want to see. And also, if you guys want that brown video, let me know down below. And yeah, don't forget to also hit subscribe. That's very important if you guys want to see me again. Because, you know, you're still watching, so you must want to see me again. And yeah, thank you guys for getting to watch this video. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.